The orderly said you want to see me again. I just told Lucky and I wanted you to know that I have decided to take a paternity test. If I do it now, the odds that it'll affect the child are one in a hundred, which I think it's worth it to know which of you is the father. Okay. Well, if, if you are comfortable with taking the test now, then so am I. I'm not. Lucky, it's fine. The doctor who examined me said, physically, I am very healthy. The baby is gonna be fine. Yeah, I'm also concerned about your state of mind. I mean, you need to concentrate on getting well before you make plans for the future. Yeah, you might have a point. You've already had so much pressure. Mostly self-imposed. Look, I, I wanna know who the father is right now, but I feel like I, need to show some restraint, so if Lucky's prepared to wait for the test results, then I guess so am I. Restraint would be nice. Elizabeth, look, the best thing for you and the baby is for you to heal. But you already said you don't see a future with me. So, knowing who the father is, will only free us all up to move on with our lives. Glad you guys waited. In session, go. Well, it's nice that Lainey has agreed to talk to me. Did you make a decision? We had a long discussion about the paternity test, and I know what I need to do. I think the stress of waiting and not knowing is greater than just getting it done. I need to know who's the father of my baby. So I have an appointment tomorrow with Kelly at the hospital and she will need a DNA sample from the both of you. As long as you think it's the right time. Uh, yeah, I do. Oh, I'm, I'm glad you're doing it right away. This baby deserves to be welcomed with joy no matter who the father is. Lucky, wait, can I speak to you for a minute? I'd really rather not, apart from trying to help Elizabeth. I can't stand the sight of you. It brings up too many memories of the brother that I thought you were, how much I trusted you. Look, I, I know things are bad between us, but we need to find a way to coexist, no matter whose child this is. As much as I want to, it's pretty much impossible for me to cut you out of my life here. You're my mother's son, you're Lulu's brother. And for their sake, I'll find a way to coexist, as you put it. It's the best I can do.